There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below. But for now, today's question. The question, why does hypertension cause nosebleeds? Well, I'm not a doctor, or a physiologist, or have any kind of deep knowledge of circulatory anatomy and physiology, but the basics I know suggests that nosebleeds can be explained by thinking about plumbing. The surrounding tissues in our noses are very thin, and quite susceptible to damage through changes in humidity and mechanical damage. Try blowing your nose too vigorously in a cold dry climate. I know a lot of people besides myself who are very familiar with nosebleeds in those conditions. The vessels inside the nose seem to be more sensitive to pressure changes than other places in our bodies, and so combining the relative thinness of the vessel walls and the exposure of the supporting mucosal tissues leads me to suspect erosive forces internally and externally lead to breaking the vessel walls and using up a stack of tissues to staunch the flow. I hope that helps. If you need more answers and advice on hypertension I've included some links in the description.